Hi guys, today I want to talk to you a little bit about neighborhood news within Moxie Engage. Neighborhood news is a great way to reach out to your clients on a monthly basis, just letting them know about the neighborhood, letting them know what their neighbor's house is for sale for, what it's sold for, some market statistics, just a great email. I kind of call it the nosy, nosy neighbor email that most people aren't going to be offended to be getting in their inbox, but also intrigued by what's going on. So it's very simple to do. And then I challenge you every single day to go in and add five people to your neighborhood news. It's very simple to do with an engage because right when you come to the dashboard, you have this stay and flow right here at the top. Reach out to five people today. So it has these five people right here. Once you reach out to them today, add them all to neighborhood news. Tomorrow it's going to give you five new people. This will start to multiply and then these people will start getting an email from you once a month. So it's very simple to do. I wanna show you two different ways to do it. First, right here from the dashboard, there's a little drop down for reach out. You go down to neighborhood news and there's two ways to create a neighborhood news. I'll show you the first one. The quick one is gonna be off a zip code. So it's gonna have their email address populated here at the top. You put in the zip code and it's gonna be set. You hit done, you're good to go those emails are gonna be going out to them once a month. Close that out, show you the second way. This is the way I recommend because it's gonna be more accurate and more specific to their neighborhood. A zip code has a large variety of um, house prices and types of houses within a zip code. So you wanna do it as custom as possible. So when you do custom, it's pretty cool. It pulls up a map here and you can go in and zero in on things that are very specific. You could go in and zero in on the school district that they're in, the school that they go to. So just homes within a certain high school like Riverbend High School District. Um, for this one, I'm going to give you an example. We're just going to do um, a quick little shot of downtown Fredericksburg. So there's two ways you can do it. You can do a multi draw and you can do a quick draw. So quick draw I find very easy. And let's just say we wanted to do it all the way around downtown, go through the river over here, back up and around here. So now their neighborhood news is gonna be only homes that fall in this boundary line that we created here. Sold homes, active homes, and so on. So you would just hit next. Okay, so once the report is all populated, all you have to do is go over here and hit the send to button in the bottom right, and you're all set. And you can just start doing that over and over again for each person that you send it to. So you can also go into a particular person and let's see here. I go into Michaela Moxie. But when you go into the person, you're going to land like on their profile page right here and you're going to scroll down to add subscriptions. And you have two different types here, but we're going to add neighborhood news. You click that again you could do the quick one or you could do the targeted custom search so we hit go um, and this time we'll do it a little bit differently let's um, zoom out here let's go to a different area let's zoom in and we're going to go to draw multi draw this time and let's just say we wanted to take uh, the area right here around L'Oreal Park as their main area. You're going to see we get a new population of homes over here to the left. And we'll hit next. Choose who we want it to go to. It's going to populate a sample of what that's going to look like and what the full report looks like. And you can scroll through here and get a good idea of what it's going to look like for your clients on their side. I also recommend setting this up for yourself, but just has some great content, great information, really good um, looking graphics and just simply um, simple information for them. And it lets them know that homes that are in the areas, you can see your specific properties that they have that are available for them. So we're going to go ahead and hit send. And then we're all set. So my challenge to you guys is that you do this for five people every single day until you've got your whole entire database receiving neighborhood news. And that's really going to help boost your listing leads and it's really going to help keeping yourself on top of mind awareness for anyone that might be looking for homes. Thank you guys very much. I'll see you guys next time.